now it's into the three o'clock turn and a much better French turn, bar some setbacks over on the left here. So near La Haye Saint, the Hanoverians around here suddenly turned and shifted uh, and well, charged, uh, assaulted the, the flank of those French lines, uh, causing some, uh, some routes and really uh, damaging French morale. Uh, they had pushed up into those heights. You can see they were really about to hit the Brunswickers and now they've, they've pulled back a little bit. It's just shaken their nerves a little. Uh, well, there was a bit of a cavalry skirmish out on the left here with uh, losses on both sides. Um, nothing too disastrous. Uh, but in the centre here, the French had uh, some good uh, assault rolls forcing some more routes and you can see right around here pushing through a little bit uh, and behind the lines the units are rallying very well recovering from that disorder that's going um, it's enabling the French to continue with these assaults third to the right Imperial Guard artillery is setting up and shifting to Hougoumont more guards casualties uh, again some more Light company losses, uh, some shaken nerves in and around Hougamont. And further to the right, more King's German Legion losses. The French now have a good battery set up on those heights there. Uh, they have very brave uh, infantry charges against artillery, has eliminated uh, two of the British uh, artillery batteries in the area. You can see behind the lines here, uh, I think these are Hanoverians and they may be King's German Legion to their left setting up. Yeah, King's German Legion here setting up to uh, prepare, prepare for the loss of Hougamont. That looks like it's going to happen very soon. And further to the right, the cavalry didn't do much uh, at all. It was again very quiet out in that sector. But again, behind the lines in the east, the Prussians and the Imperial Guard are setting up for engagement. The Guard are moving up uh, towards the Prussians. They have the 4th Cavalry Corps in support on their left. That's the, the French left. Well, really the French centre, the, uh, the left or western side of, of the Guard. You can see them moving down north along these parallel roads. Are moving up towards the Prussians, hoping to not only support this assault on the Hague Saint, but also to, I guess, bring the battle to the Prussians and force them to, um, force them to fight. I guess, I guess, French terms, where the French want to fight, rather than waiting for the Prussians to come to them, which does leave Napoleon way back here at the Belle Alliance by himself. But he has a good, um, a good view of what's going on around him. So yeah, uh, mainly I guess this turn was the French inflicting some heavy casualties. I, I mean, I just did a casualty take that turn, but these are the new casualties, lost units in that turn there, including some guards units. Um, again, mostly allied units being lost. So that's into the three o'clock turn. We'll see what the three twenty turn brings um, with a renewed. I guess a series of French assaults.